Burning in the chest, difficulty swallowing, dry cough, or hoarseness. These are all symptoms of acid reflux. It affects 60% of the adult population in the U.S. And a lot of times, the symptoms can be tamed with medicine or adjusting your diet. Some cases, maybe there's uh, a need for surgery. Melanie joins us with how a new procedure that a local hospital is offering is helping patients get permanent relief. Well, it's called the MUSE procedure, Bruce, and it's only being offered here locally at St. Vincent's Hospital. The gastroenterologist who is performing the procedure says it could one day be the easiest and best way to treat GERD in patients who don't get relief with medication. Jeannie Barsick used to have trouble finishing a complete sentence. It would be like this. Healthy habits can protect... <coughs> She was constantly clearing her throat. She had no idea the problem was asthma, triggered by acid reflux. Or spreading germs at home, work, and school. <coughs> it would get into severe choking. I mean, it wasn't just clearing the throat. It was, it was, it was stuff that was coming up. Dr. Ali Lankarani, a gastroenterologist with Borland Groover Clinic, works at St. Vincent's Hospital. He evaluated Barsic and knew medication wasn't an option. She needed surgery. You might be able to see the staples, five staples in each mm -hmm. location. Lankarani had just started doing the MUSE procedure and knew Barzik was a good candidate. I told him I would jump on it immediately because I, I wanted relief. Um, my life was just miserable. Now with this procedure, we can uh, fix the valve that is between the stomach and the esophagus, make it tighter so the acid reflux become controlled without having to go undergo surgery. The procedure is FDA approved, but not yet covered by insurance. Lankrani is part of a group who is doing it free of charge for select patients and monitoring those patients for five years afterwards to see if their GERD is getting better. This is the esophagus. You have the stomach. And this is the scope. This is a surgical endostapler that is um, basically installed on a endoscope, flexible endoscope that we in insert through the mouth, go through the esophagus, go to the stomach, and what we can do is that with the help of this uh, instrument, we can push the stomach up all the way to the esophagus and deploy staples. Patients usually are monitored and experience chest discomfort for 24 hours. They go on soft foods after that for eight days, but afterwards... It was not painful. It was, it was totally bearable. Um, and it, it, it took, I mean, right away, the, the biggest part was not being able to eat or drink. Now, three months later, Barsic says she can hear the difference. Fine. I mean, I can eat anything. Um, the, the, the throat is getting much better. It's not the way it used to be. She says she's a completely different woman. Now, St. Vincent's Healthcare is the third hospital system in the country to offer patients the MUSE surgery. Dr. Lankrani says he is very selective with the patients he chooses. But if you want more information, call Borland Groover Clinic. They'll connect you with Dr. Lankrani. You can also find more information on newsforjax.com. It's on the health page and also on the morning show page.